Hey guys, it's Monica. I'm going to share with you a quick color comparison. I absolutely love this wig. This is Raquel Welch Flirt Alert. Now I have Raquel Welch Editor's Pick as well, but my Flirt Alert is in a very, I think it's a really pretty warm shade. This is actually Shaded Wheat in the Raquel Welch line, Shaded Wheat. Hopefully you can see it. I'm gonna do a, a little spin for you, just so you can see the back. I know many of you are very, very familiar with this style and this color. It's not anything new, but, but for me recently, I bought a Flirt Alert in Shaded Biscuit. I have really loved that color on other people. I just didn't know if I would like it on me, to be honest with you, I really didn't. So I wasn't too sure whether it would be something I would like. I knew I'd like the wig because I like this wig. Sometimes it's it's got too much of a flip here and I have to play with it because it sometimes reminds me of that like flying nun little flip. But anyways, so I got the exact same color in Shade Biscuit. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> I just really, I think this is so pretty. So I thought what I would do is show you what this looks like on me. <laughs> what do you think? This is Shaded Biscuit. I, this is a color I have been eyeballing forever, but I always felt it would be too light for me. And I, it is actually too light for me. But I got it and I wanted to see it. I wanted to compare it because because I love the blondes. So anyways, for those of you that are considering Shaded Biscuit, it is a beautiful blend. You can see some of the lighter brown rooting and you can see the lighter wefts of hair or the lighter fibers near the hairline, which I think makes a big difference, a big difference. So, this is her in Shaded Wheat. I'm going to show you the cap. Typical Raquel Welch. It does have a really nice lace front, and then it has a, it's sort of, you know, a generous where you can move your pot around a little bit, monofilament stretchy fiber there is some permatease but with this style you need to have permatease otherwise it's just going to to me it's just going to lay flat so so what do you think i asked jay and i said jay do you like this color on me and um he said no <laughs> He didn't actually like the color on me. He actually felt that it looked like my hair was white or gray. And so he felt that that aged me. He liked this better because of the darker shades of blonde. So I was kind of interesting and, you know, interested in obviously his opinion because typically he's very much, oh, whatever, whatever you want to wear, honey, you know, type of a guy. So this is just a quick color comparison. For those of you that might have been curious, the same wig, different colors. What do you think? <laughs> I like it. Anyways, this wig was purchased with my own funds. And yeah, I think it looks pretty, I think it looks pretty nice. I really, I really like it a lot. I do think though, that this color probably does look better on me. But if I want to be in that sort of uh, blonde vibe, this would do it. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye-bye.